and pick out your own seats. Hamill against the side. He's got Gehrig. Still with Gehrig. Works to the left foot. Can he hook it back? It's a great goal. Beautifully done. Hamill has Did really you? stood up today. He's enjoyed this contest against his former teammates. Try and eat. He finds Fraser Gehrig. Saints are not gone yet. From outside of 50, Gehrig pumps it home. Pumps it home. Xavier Clark was standing flat foot as an inexperienced player. He didn't continue to push down to assist. There's a chance for Fraser Gehrig. Can he get one back for the Saints? Gehrig, 25 metres out, kicks a goal. They're still alive. That's exactly what the doctor would have ordered. Good left foot kick, looking for low. Goes up, couldn't quite hold the mark. Did well though, got the handball going to Thompson. Now to Gehrig, over the top. Nice one-two going there with Cripps. Here's Fraser Gehrig, shot at goal. Put it through, Fraser likes it, and the Saints got their second, and they're back within two points. Fifth possession coming up, as you can see there on screen. Nick Rewalt for the perfect start for the Saints in this set half. Kick from about 55 metres out. On its way. Goes to the goal square. Up goes Wolf, got plenty of it. Couldn't quite bring it down. Gehrig tries to make something at ground level and does. Goal to Fraser Gehrig, his third. He brushes the tackle off. Kick is long to the square. Flying out of the top lodge. Milne the step up. He was caught, but he dished off the spider on his favoured side. Won't make the distance. Who can get under it? St Kilda, three on two. Garrick threaded the goal. This is St Kilda's best ever first quarter against the Blues. Car under the pump. Back to Bell. Hit smothered. Fremantle under enormous pressure. Brown comes through, he's knocked off it by Milne, Carr goes again, he's tackled, Grover to Crowe, left it behind, he's ridden to the ground by Hudson, St Kilda with sheer termination, win it out, here's Garrick from 40 metres out, wonderful team goal by the Saints! And then grubs the ball. Trying to hit a target. Here's Ozzie Jones to Xavier Clark. He's quick, super quick. Penetrating kick. Getting back, Fraser Gehrig. He's got the drop. Great punch away that time by Thornton. Gehrig kicks it off the ground and kicks a goal. Pumps the ball back towards Kosicki. He'll get support from Hamill as well around the corner. Diving at the ball, couldn't take it. That was Capuano. Harvey over the ball, they'll pile on top. McCormick burrows in after the ball. So does Hayes. What a player he's been tonight. Loose ball. Harvey, the playmaker, the general, goes wide. He's looking for Powell. He can run onto it to Rewolf. Under pressure to Powell. Hits a target. Gives it to Fraser Geary. Kicks a goal. Capuano long to within 30, so a chance for the Saints. Gary need to do it in a hurry. He's got the chance. No pressure. Nails it. His ball. Not a good handball. Chopped off by Hamill. Able to keep it in. High ball. Got out. Can he get involved? Loney the spoil. Harvey has lost. Burke intended target at the moment. Towers is crunched. Burke good handball. Thompson. Corrals it in, still has Boss, goes short, Murray at the back, Gary can't control it, Hay, risky, effective, no, Gary goal. Yeah, they can't believe how that occurred. No better position really, but he can link up over the top, Hayes doesn't want to have a shot from there, instead he pit for it, Gary. well worked by the Saints, Gary took a long time to have his shot, a long time. But he's done the job, he's kicked the goal. Ball runs free, Clot looking for the boundary, trying to punch it there, didn't succeed, Glass did well though. Back to Clot, Warren, sold into trouble, taken down by Del Santo, chance for Jones, pops it inside the 50. Will we see the first goal of the match? In goes Gehrig, 20 metres out, 10 
Williams at home, does he? Goal on fire is tucked a long way left. It's a goal. So either way, the Saints, Clark, long towards the goal square. Gearing trying to help him on its way. Cut glass on his way. It bounced a blade in the line. A puppy dog to Gearing and he kicks a goal. His third. Blake, looks like a goal. Montagna, irrelevant, is indeed. Although every decision you would think is relevant if we're going to play at this elite level, Gary. The result. Stake up, yes, you're quite right. Murray, dodging, weaving. Around the body work, Punda lies down on the ground behind the plate. That looks serious. Maguire, it does, still hasn't moved. Gary, in the meantime, can kick a goal. A certain goal for Fraser Gary, goal number four. I think Stafford put uh, one hand in the face of Maguire at the ruck contest. Allegation about Stafford was made once earlier in the year too. Here's Gary. Wasting no time. From 45, he has done it. McKay waits down. Kaczynski goes to spoil. At the front, McCormick and Kudafidis and Hamill. Off the left, into the square again. Garrick kept his feet, and that's why he got the goal. Well played, Fraser Garrick. His 50th goal for the year, and he's sixth of the afternoon. Well, match, uh, you got to get him down there so he can use his cool head under pressure because the ball's spending all the time down there. Baker to Garrick, Harvey, Shepherds, and Garrick slots it. Saints on fire. Little handball comes up to Hamill nicely from Rewald. Kick not so good. That no, was perfect. Maguire, 60 from goal. Slips it towards full forward. Gary waiting back. Big chance. Around the body. And finally the Saints get one through. Goddard waiting for Hamill to scoot past. Looks up. He's told just to kick it long. Get it down to Rewald. Bassett committed his body. Mill. Should handball to Gary. Steady are coming up for the Saints. And Gary very laconically <laughs> puts it through. Just more class, more class in this St Kilda team. And we're seeing it in the final quarter. This to just about nail it. Still in play, still alive. Game still alive. Gary, Gary. In the clear, running hard and chasing hard. Backing back is Goddard. He's a Garrick's got to kick goal number five. He is killing Geelong now. Haven't got a presenting half forward at the moment. Nothing, nothing for Brown to go to. He kicked into nowhere. Land. No man's land except big Fraser Gary. Uses ball again, the number one possession winner on the ground. And he uses it so well. His 11th possession to Rewild and now Gary. Just it beautifully in the pocket. Has a look across the shoulder. And he's Another possession for ball. He chips it to Thompson. Overlap provided by Hayes. The Saints away again. Long inside. Attacking 50. Gary. Well, it wasn't quite inside attacking 50. Fraser Gary plays on. He runs to 45. Gary kicks it over. The Saints' biggest test to date. In the most hostile of territory. Clark favoured by a short throw in. Guerra had his chance, had his moment. Thompson, Gary, and he's done it. And the lead changes for the seventh time. Maguire clears, it's a good kick too, it finds perhaps fortuitously Aussie Jones, Lenny Hayes, that's his 24th touch, here's Gary, he's got four, swings onto the left, shouldn't miss and nails it. So far on both sides, Gary again out of the ruck, this time he does it himself and kicks the goal, it was a handy rehearsal before. Kicks back towards half-forward, Revolt has marked about 65 metres out. Honours the lead from Gehrig, it bounces down in that direction. Gehrig works Lynch off the ball, very clever, a goal.
His first. As Schwartz goes up the revolt, 23 seconds and counting. Last chance, last roll of the dice. Up to Big Fraser. Gehrig! Off hands. Milne's lurking. Gehrig's got it. One hundred and one. Gehrig's kicked his fifth. They've got the ton. And there again, you saw sort of three St Kilda Ruckman, if you like. It's Bills for Lenny Hayes. It'll take back out. Milne for two and two minutes. Dances around, was leg nearly. Now he sets up and has a shot. Look at that for strength. Gehrig just pushes the ball out of the way and kicks another. Pure strength beat Brennan Favola on that occasion. And then the school kicked the goal. Noble gets the tap. They get the clearance. Look at that. Harvey out to Hayes. Beautiful play. That's 11 zip now. Bad bounce. Picked up now by Ball. Ball inside short. Weirer around the body. The bounce might beat Favola here. No, he did it well. Did it well enough, but it's going to be a goal anyway. To his immediate opponent, and three now to Fraser Gehrig. The handball from Hamill over the top. And poor old Brennan Favola caught between the devil and the deep blue sea. Thompson, Hayes, class, wide baker. Saints with rhythm. Go forward, Hamill. Had his man done. Gehrig could have given and should have given the handball, but he didn't need to because he bent it back and kicked the fifth of the corner. Gets it away. Hayes inside 50. Here's ha here he is. Gehrig <laughs> doesn't quite know what to do. He wants to get around under the left boot. Kick a goal. That's what he wanted to do. And he did it. That's eight for Fraser Gehrig. Inside the centre square. Told to play on. Wants to go with his left boot. Not a bad effort. Oh, well done, Gehrig. Open goal beckons, finally! His first. Well, they've been labouring as they go forward. Tear impersonation. Noble slaps it forward, beautiful play by Del Sando at the Schwartz. Voss is on it, in a half forward, all on his own, he waits. Couldn't quite hold it, Hay did it well, but it's going to be punished anyway as Garrett gets two in a minute. The G train's back on the rails. Spider gets the tap, but again it was Harvey who roved it to power. In it comes. Fraser waits for the bounce and gets it. Oh, he's got five. Party time for the Saints. And ball's off. Ball. The foot chip was a beauty. Look at that one. Hey, that, that is an incredibly good kick. Yep. You, you probably can't pay it at due justice while we're running through the call here. It's gone to the fat side again. Fraser. Pickett's kick was equally good. Put it out. Fraser didn't even have to run hard. Now Gary plays on. No one watching. Left foot to the goal square. Forget the goal square. To the goal. And he puts it through for goal number four for the big G-boy. It's a bad miss from Adam McPhee. Dermot, it, it just seems to get so close. He actually hit it with the instep of his foot as well, and when you get close, you tend to elevate them, yep. and then you hook them left predominantly. And as a result, here we go for the 11-point turnaround as Gehrig runs in and nails close. This game would say goal number five. And McPhee might have missed with a kick at goal, but he won't miss kicking himself. Now Bassett. Chance for the Crows to counter-attack through Shirley. Handball smothered. Ricochet to Stone. Now to Goddard. The turnover. Man in space is Gehrig. 20 metres out. Makes them pay. That's what happens when the Saints get some space. St Kilda try and work it forward. Voss now. Inside 50. Getting the front spot. There's Petri. Good play there. What wonderful play by Revolt. The ball comes to the ground. Black on the left foot. Up towards full foot. Gehrig got the front spot. Now he's kicked it out of his shoulder. And kicked a wonderful goal to open proceedings. Fraser, Gehrig and Black combining, fantastic stuff. The Saints have the first on the board. Now he'll drive the ball long, here's the G-Train. Gehrig marks from the chest. Kangaroo defenders can't get near him, he plays on. Wheels from 50, five minutes inside the boundary line. Gehrig's got a couple. The Saints have got three. Dynamic start for the Saints. For the Saints, Montagna. Driving ball, Gehrig, what in support. Archie well, but Gehrig outmaneuvered. Paid the mark, could have given the handball to Hamill. Ran on himself, Gehrig lines up and has got it. Gehrig has kicked three goals in the first quarter. Luke Ball finds Rewalt, too far out to score. See, Lenny Hayes, he just ran through 
Shot forward of the mark. Doesn't seem to be running all that quick or all that freely. Gehrig, strength battle with Markley, wins out Montagna. Handles in Gehrig's direction. Great play, Fraser! Now they need it finished. He's got a one-on-one -on -one with Fraser. They run back to try and support him. Copeland. Gehrig's got four to beat. Copeland thumps it down. Gehrig beats all four. Super goal. Forlorn hope here. Revolt with the numbers against him again. Hayes arrives. Two against Gehrig. Michael controlling it. Well done, Noble. Gehrig open goal. Xavier Clark to half forward. Revolt gets in front of Lepic and takes a good mark. Just give him a chance, one out, and uh, you would back Revolt against Lepic. The lead's on from Gehrig. Well, nicely done. An event so, of the 50. They have. As he gets past Michael, now Fraser Gehrig from a tight angle goes for home. And that is a tremendous goal. Find up for a while, there's Milne. Big Noble. Guerra. Here's Milne, can he get another one? Xavier Clark. Fraser, come on! He's got it! There's 98. Sixth for the night for Fraser Gary. Patched up and ready to get back into the hustle and bustle. Burgoyne. Turns it over. Ball composed enough. And now Gehrig's loose. Will he have a shot? He takes on the responsibility. And that's number 99. And more importantly, number one for the Saints. Gehrig doubling back. Revolt, the close option. First mission accomplished. He can go over the top here if he wants. And he just gets away with it. This is Ball. Gehrig leads hard into the pocket. No one back in the square, so he's almost forced to go to Gehrig in the end. He was on his right side, straight into action. Fraser Gehrig for five! Oh, he's keeping the minutes! But he just didn't take any clean marks, and once again, he's got that ability to take a mark there under no real pressure and fumbled the ball. Ferrito and Petrie flew. The ball comes out to Ozzy Jones. Mark Michael Stevens with a good chase. Kick towards the front of the goal square. Hamill doing the crummy. One way, then the other quickly around the corner. But the kick favoured. Brown couldn't clear the congestion. And Fraser Gehrig gets his fourth of the afternoon. Guerra called to go. Left foot kicks it in the river's direction. He's going to have a fly at this. Got hands to it. Milne at ground level. We'll have a dip. Don't worry about that. But the Fraser, this time... Gets the jukes around the ball, plays on and cannot miss. It's behind the mark, you can go. Will load up on the left from half back, just kicks it high in the air. Having to stand under it, McDonald. Turn over the Saints. Voss, long ball forward, Milne. Brown, Gary, look at big phrase. Stands, gets around Rivers and kicks a goal. Great effort. Got three. He can run to 50. He can nearly get the distance from here. Put it to the top of the square. Well, well, a kick off hands. Look at Mick Fraser. His eyes were like golf balls waiting for that one. And he nails it. Got his second. Ozzy Jones. All sorts of space. Goes for Goddard. Beautiful kick. Chase Greg. <laughs> Let's not be stupid, Gary. It's got a goes into the centre. Back to Ozzy Jones. Can Fraze get it and kick number eight? He's got his man beaten. Got the one hand to it. Ducks and weaves. Steps around the tackle. Can straighten up Big Fraser and kick goal number eight. Andrew McLeod won't uh, be complaining tonight about the tagging. You saw him dragging the arm of Luke Ball up towards the G-Train. First contest of the night. It's over the head of Rutten as well. Coming in to his Fiore. Gets it over to Gary. Here's the shot. Kicks the first goal. How about that? Fraser Gary. 
Away he goes. Well, that's at the cheat train. We'll talk about the cold blue eyes of Big Nick. <laughs> I reckon Fraser's he might get one anyway. He might. He might. He does. He has six. Not with this play because St Kilda go back inside their 50. Revolt in front. It's got the free. Play on. And the cheat train's got number seven. Clark could be a target. He looks a real player. Ackland goes wide, looking for Fraser Gerrig this time. Too big. Just puffed up the chest, and Fraser runs in and kicks a goal. Seventy metres out, kicks inside the fifty, coming back with the flood. And Ackland was up, couldn't complete the mark. McWalter snaps. It floats towards the line, Geary dropped the mark, turns around, two bombers standing nearby, and he kicks the goal. The ball's going, and Stephen Milne at the moment will get his stats up. Oh, two no. kicks. There's no crumbs for him to get hold of. Kozicki slipped. Geary waiting back. Big Fraser! Goal number three! That's the best way to respond. There's another turnover. Oh, well done, Milne. Slip That's the customer. one. That's the one, says Wayne. Gehrig's got it. That's the one indeed. Oh, go and coach Wayne. Gehrig's got another goal. In fact, don't go and coach. We want you up here. So it's one out. Gehrig and Gasper. Gasper did brilliantly work to the front. Gehrig a snap from 30 metres. He puts it through. No, he's missed it just, has he? No, he's kicked it. Well done, Fraser Gehrig. He's been busy since coming onto the ground. Oh, gee, an ordinary-looking kick into the path of Gehrig. Oh, it's a wrestle down there. Gehrig gets rid of Carroll. He runs, can run into an open goal here. He does. He goals. Fraser Gehrig kicks his first of the afternoon. Leads Ferguson to the ball this time. Off to Hamill. It'll open up for Baker, but it actually went too far. Oh, terrible calamity from Carroll, Baker over the top and Gary gets a gift he rams it home they're running hot again but tonight he's been stopped in his tracks by Matthew Scala thrown in, Revolt, Thompson oh. look away, hand pass, well I've queued him up on cue he puts the ball through send the check Fraser Luke Paul can have a bounce, goes inside the Swiss Square, gets some support from Voss, tumbles the kick up towards Maguire. He's got a taste for the goals from a long range, goes towards the pocket, wonderful kick, lovely build up. This time Fraser takes an easy chest mark, tight angle, plays on quickly, opens it up. Fraser for his first, he's got it. The Saints have two. He's fired up Fraser Garrick today, isn't he? Aaron Hamill has it 65 metres out from goal. Revolt in the square, decides to go up to it. Garrett, good kick, good mark. And Fraser was able to get that ample chest in the way and take a bit of pressure off that sore thumb of his. He's played on straight away. Look at this, the G train. How many is he kick from that pocket? Left foot, absolute beauty. He did it last week and he gets the Saints back in the game. The former Port Adelaide player played 12 games in four years. Now he's the Saints' regular number one ruckman. And Harvey is everywhere. Yeah, Ben Matthews on Harvey must tighten up. Now Gary got an awkward half volley, oh, but that is cleared from Leo Barry. Let go, guys. See, see, I'm right there, Power. And Gary seizes the moment. Could he nail the moment? Yes, he can. The Saints lead by eight points, and they're on a roll. Swans have pushed some extra tall men back deep, but he blazes anyway. Hopes for Gary, or maybe Revolt. Maybe it is Fraser. Maybe. maybe Lenny Hayes, he can run the wing with a couple of bounces. Has the second, thinks about a third, has the third. Judge got in, missed him. Sends the kick inside, 50. High bomb, up they fly. Three eagles, Fraser. down is Fraser. Runs through, bang! Well done, Fraser. He's got two. Last ball came out. Fiora runs down towards half forward. How's that for end-to-end -end stuff? And Del Santo's got it. Right on the 50, Gehrig wants it long to the square, out. awkward for Gaspar, Gehrig did the hard work, lost the football, still going, snaps the goal. He's a 
Wild Beast. Clark, third man up and missed it. Ball knocked down to Xavier Clark. High kick, Gary got there, didn't mark it, will kick the goal regardless. Runs in and goes wham. He's got three. Bad luck for the Saints. Revolt knocked it down. Mill missed it. Hamill across to Del Santo. Stood up in the tackle. Gets it back to a teammate there in Montagna. Long of the square. Back goes Fraser and hacks it out of midair for a goal. Voss. Wide to Schwarz. Just centers it. Hits the goal square. A bouncing ball. Gehrig's down there. It bounces for him. And he slips it through. Scores a level. So Nick Revolt, who's been very active, the leading possession winner on the ground with his 12th disposal. Gary keeps Harris at bay. Does it brilliantly from 40. Drop putty. Brings it back. And oh. nails it. Ho oh, ho. Great stuff from Fraser Gary. That's his third. Got it now, plenty of time, directing traffic as he goes, kicks towards half-forward, gee, it was a good kick, Fiora was able to get in behind the defence, plays on, kick to the goal screen, Gehrig in a great spot here, couldn't hold on, but he'll snap a goal, Fraser, he does, he kicks his fifth. Hayes goes deep to the hot spot, Blues have got numbers back there, Lappin spoiling, two Carlton players collide, as if they have to give the Saints any more goals. Gehrig gets his third. Very, very good player. Long ball forward. Melbourne defence thumping away, but straight into the hands of Fraser Gehrig, who walks in and kicks the Saints second in a row. Got him out of trouble. Fisher's kick is out in front of ball. Strong overhead. Did well ball. Left foot kick around the corner. Dear, Boy. Dear. Bowled a couple of demons somehow. Swartz to Harvey. Harvey looking for support. Gary gets there. Goes and gets it. And Fraser has nailed his second goal. For Peckett, who has the city win. Now, he can go all the way here. And he's got the sniff. He's got the gleam in his eye. But being a team player, he gives it to Gary. Gehrig's had the gleam in his eye all day. He goes for home and he spears it through. And the margin is 94. Kick around the body, got to its intended target, Milne, who's away. Perhaps now for the Saints. Long towards Gary, who's one out with Solomon, too much strength. Oh, he wants to play on Gary. Gets around Solomon, or does he? He does, runs to 30 and kicks and kills first. Voss to help him out, Del Santo. And it's open at the other end of the ground now. Gehrig and Solomon having their test of strength. Gehrig's winning it, winning it, winning it well. This is their run, which has been as good as the dogs, better than the dogs. Montagna got it from Del Santo. Montagna goes to the pocket. Fraser clears a little space. But he's paid. St Kilda left footed midfielder with the silky disposal and Gehrig it was a brilliant kick a moment ago can he do it again yes he can alongside the center circles his side up by 10 points yes. Montagna penetrating kick well inside the forward 50 ball attracted a crowd Gehrig gets the crown and kicks a goal Jones, the first gamer. Yeah. Lots of blonde hair to half forward. Griffin. And as you dish the handball out to McMahon, there's West. Good tackle on board. Turn over. Clark Harvey. Handball over the G train. Here's the perfect start for the Saints. Good, ferocious tackling up forward. Calls the spill. 
Montagna hurries one out towards right half forward. They need a goal to steady proceedings. Harvey is a man who could manufacture one. Del Santo, 52 metres out. Wonderful kick. Gehrig! Suddenly we've got a shootout. Gehrig plays on, kicks a goal. They're first in 13 minutes. Del Santo, still a chance here. Gehrig's on his own. Play on. He's going to match Fev. Three goals in the third, five for the night. Oh, oh. Well done, Luke. Revolt has to mark it. No, he doesn't. Gary can kick the goal. They fly regardless through Raf Clark. Gilbert going through without it. Mackey's been terrific down back this year, but lost out on that occasion. It's Scarlett, it's Gary, the G train for number 500. He wants the footy as a souvenir. <laughs> nope. Tanya's kick was clever actually on the side of the boot. Revolt to Voss, and now we have this one on one. Can he take advantage of it? He does. This is what the Saints needed. Cheekily, Gary strolls in and goes. Right, what's he going to do with the football? Kicks it back to the G-Train, he takes it on the chest, he plays on, he thumbs up for Newman and he goes for home and the G-Train drills it. That was clever. Here's Harvey who kicked it in there, trying to get it to Ralph Clark. In fact he gets it to Baker, surrounded, clever, clever kick. Gehrig has got it again, wrong side. They lead by 28 points. They're pulling away. And Graham wins it. In spite of his name, he's becoming oh. a heavyweight for St Kilda. Milne did well to control it there. Saints go for it again. Gary getting rid of Wakeland. The goal unguarded. Where will it go? Oh. It's home. Here come the Saints. over by Fraser, St Kilda Stowe though still with possession as Montagna deftly kicks it out wide to Hayes Lenny Hayes drives it long inside attacking 50, Gehrig and Wakeland Wakeland in front, couldn't take the mark Gold set with the long sleeves in this final quarter, Gehrig just pushes off and kicks around the body to a vacant goal square, bounces through oh Fraser you're a star running straight at the man on the mark who must have been wondering what was going on Sam Fisher goes for Gehrig Good placement, Gehrig able to wait, read the bounce. And there's a hold and a free kick to Gehrig by the looks of it. It is, oh. he wastes no time. Now has to balance, couldn't use the left, <laughs> uses the right exquisitely. And in game number 250, the G train kicks his first. Fiora once more, Harvey. Breaking away a little too easily there goes for Gary. And the G train powers on and kicks his fourth goal in his 250th game. Advantage called here and Fiora breaks away for the Saints. Now Baker, who's doing some good uh, attacking things, good kick to Gary. Oh, Perfectly well. weighted on the G train. Runs in and rams home his fifth. Getting it forward to Fiora. Simpson with him. Line ball. Simpson did okay. Carazzo arriving. And Murphy. Good pressure from Harvey. Fiora once more. Flicks it out for Harvey. Maguire. Bannister got him. Montagna. And Del Santo on the non-preferred. Gehrig one out. Can finish it off. It is 250th. He kicks his sixth. And that'll do. And that's a good play to Montagna. Graham's been outstanding. Gets to 50. High ball to full forward. Revolt. Not quite. The G train kicks the goal. A bit of size there, Tom Lyon, isn't he? And he just had a look at his teammate there saying, where was the support coming over the top? Harry yeah, Taylor wrapped up Gehrig, and Gehrig runs in and goals.
And they'll pay the advantage. Harry that was a hanger. Good kick in the middle too to Graham who continues running. Now can he kick a long monster? Garrick's there. He monsters his opponent and kicks his fourth. He's been great. Well good. He's been 